Okay. Come on in. Here we are for our first lesson. Hi, Brittany. Looking forward to working five different lessons, working yeah. on some different things. And I know when you filled out your questionnaire, what were some things we were looking at doing? Uh, obtaining more distance, hitting more greens in regulation, and shaping shots. Shaping shots. We're also going to work on some short game, but your short game is pretty good, right? It's not bad. Yeah, so we're going to work on some options, hitting it higher or lower, running it more or less. Um, today what we're going to work on is talking about shaping the ball more, okay? Going around trees, hitting the left pin with a hook, hitting the right pin with a fade, um, shaping it maybe a little bit higher. Good morning, Brittany. What we're going to do today is just kind of review um, what you've been working on, what you wanted to work on, and then how that's going. So I know we had a few goals mm -hmm. in mind when we started the series of lessons. So if you could just kind of go into what your goals were and then how we've been able to kind of monitor your progress. Okay. Um, I know one of the first goals was generating more club head speed, therefore hitting it a bit farther, gaining some yardage. Um, one of the other goals was hitting more greens in regulation. Yeah. Um, we've been able to monitor both of them just through my play. I play most days in a skins game out here. So I've been able to monitor the fact that I've been hitting the driver a lot farther. I've been hitting it 270. That's way farther than I have been in the past. Now so. how far was it before? Because I know one of your goals was to hit the ball further off the tee. Uh, around 240. Good. So 30 yards. What have you been doing to... Uh, in your mind, hit it further. I've been using a training aid before I play every day, so I've been swinging um, a weighted whip just to generate orange whip. Orange whip. Yep. To generate a bit more speed, so that's something that I put through my um, routine in the morning when I'm practicing and warming up. Excellent. Um, the other goal is hitting more greens in regulation. I probably only average maybe nine greens around. It's not enough, and the last couple times I've played, I've been averaging at least 14. I think and one day I hit 16 so that's getting a lot better which is giving me more birdie opportunities. Okay so we kind of knew what your goals were and and then now seeing how they're assessed so I'm just gonna have you grab the camera and film me for just a second. Okay so the main thing we were doing was when we started the lessons like anytime I'm teaching somebody is what does the student want to do which you're the student so I know on your sheet that we've got you want to hit it further and you want to hit more greens with your approach shots, okay? I think with as much practice as you've been able to put in being a tour player, uh, you've accomplished both of these. Um, so we were able to assess what you needed to do or what you wanted to do, what you needed to do, and how to do it. So we gave you some good practice routines. And then I want you to keep charting, you know, your greens and regulation, your driving distances, um, approach shots what the different yardages are so we can get more specific for you on what distance is good for you and then what distance we might have to improve on okay but so far very good yep. let's finish our lesson today thank you yep. 